about. Let's bring in the absolutely unnecessary and gratuitous obligatory unboxing knives in your stabby. We'll go ahead and cut the plastic and rip it off. Uh, this guy is going to be available for $249, which is $100 more uh, than the original Pebble. And both these are available uh, side by side, it's the original Pebble and uh, this one. No difference with the internals, it's all about the uh, externals uh, on this. We'll go ahead and pull up the box. And there is the Pebble Steel, a little dusty. Go ahead and pull it out. Really a nice quality uh, packing material. It's, it's cardboard, but it's got sort of a soft velvet feel to it. Um, comes with a uh, actual watch pillow as well. Push that off to the side for just a quick second. See what else we are going to have inside of the box. Um, again, really nice materials here. Uh, I've got another watch band. It's available in this sort of brushed steel. Also, there's a uh, sort of dark black steel uh, available. Unlike the original Pebble, though, uh, this band is proprietary to Pebble. Uh, but they did release the plans for it uh, online, so we should see uh, third-party bands coming available very soon. Uh, it's not the 208 millimeters we saw on the original Pebble. Uh, we should have a charging cable in here, too, somewhere out of Zoom. Let's see if we can keep digging in. There it is. There is the charging cable for the Pebble Steel. Push all this stuff off to the side, and let's take a quick look at the watch. We'll peel this off. To get that satisfying whooshing noise here. Uh, these guys are shipping now, but a bit of a uh, delay, usually about three to four weeks before they actually get to your door. So each pebble is going to come with two bands. Uh, if you get the black one, it'll come with the black steel, but they're both going to come with um, this leather band. So the big deal here with the pebble steel is supposed to be a more premium look and a premium feel for those that are sort of watch connoisseurs but still want the smart watch features uh, of the pebble. Uh, so on the navigation side, you still got your same three buttons here, though now they're uh, steel. Uh, they certainly feel a little bit better uh, to press. Also, some improvements here are in the charger. Uh, now, it might look the same, uh, but actually it's got a better connection, and you now have a RGB LED to let you know when it's charging, so you can sort of see your status. Otherwise, you couldn't really do it on the previous Pebble. Uh, you also have Gorilla Glass 2 here, so it'll make it much, much, much more durable. Uh, on the screen. The OS though is Pebble OS 2.0. It's the same you're going to get with the older Pebble. All the apps and stuff will work on here. Internally, uh, it's pretty much the same. Externally, though, is where all the differences are. So it really the matter of whether or not you like the sort of, say, more grown-up look uh, of the Pebble Steel, or if you prefer sort of the leather straps and sort of the customizing options that you have uh, with the original Pebble. You can see the two of them here uh, side by side. A little bit heavier, but it's got a really nice uh, weight to it. You can see what they both look like there. Uh, let's bring in some comparison devices. Uh, let's bring in the Qualcomm Talk. You can see these two guys. Certainly see difference in size between both of them. And here is the Sony Smartwatch 2. Both of those there as well. I've been using the original Pebble for a while now. I've actually really enjoyed it, so I'm very excited to take a look at the uh, Pebble Steel. Actually, I ordered one on my own. This is a review unit that the folks from uh, Pebble sent us. Let's go ahead and put it on my wrist and see what it looks like. So it definitely has a premium look to it. Uh, on the iOS side, it's iOS 7 or newer, whenever new operating systems come out. Uh, Android will be coming very, very soon, Pebble says, supporting OS 2.0, which has support for uh, their apps and a ton of other nice features. So you can see what the Pebble uh, Steel looks like. I'll sort of put this next to it. Here's the original Pebble. You can sort of see the differences when they are uh, rocking it uh, on your wrist. It really feels nice. Uh, it does have the Pebble branding on the face of it, which you, know, you might not want to uh, advertise for them, but it is there. Uh, then all your navigation buttons are there, sort of as you'd expect. On the left-hand side, your one button, again, uh, your three main buttons for uh, navigation. Anyway, guys, we'll do a full review of the Pebble. Still try different bands. Anything in particular you want to see, let me know. And of course, we'll compare it uh, to the outgoing Pebble as well. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I'm John Ranger from Techno Buffalo, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. What's up, everyone? Thank you for watching that video. If you want to see more of the latest and greatest tech news, you can subscribe to our main Techno Buffalo channel by clicking the button right down below in my pants region, or click on the buttons to your right to see more videos.